Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome back to another Cream Cat Corner stream. So, how is everyone doing? So, yesterday I said that I want to stream. Oh, God. The music is way too loud in my ear right now. <clears throat> So yeah, yesterday I said I want to stream a new game, right? And this game is what I am talking about. It's a game called Tunche, and I got it on the Epic Game Store for free. I think it was last week or the last two weeks. I don't remember, but I did get it for free. So I thought, why not? Why not try it, right? So yeah, I don't know what kind of game it is. All I know is that there's Head Girl from Head in Time, but that's it. I know, I know that's it. So why not we explore the game together, shall we? I don't even know what Tunche means. It must mean something. The sprite is lovely though. In the bottom left, sorry, is it left? Right, right hand corner. Oh. What? Oh, is it a multiplayer game? But I don't have it. I don't have anyone to play with, but eh. Uh. I don't know which one to choose. Maybe this little rascal? Sure. Karu. New content. Dark Heroes. A new menace roams the jungle and it's up to you to defeat it. You can now fight against the dark heroes, even the evil versions of the game protagonists. In order to challenge a specific dark hero, you will first have to defeat the final boss and read the four story chapters of the corresponding character. Okay, interesting. What the hell? Is that is that kid a bird? Whoa! Okay, so triangle is projectile. Uh, square is melee. Nice. Circle is dash, air dash. Oh, okay. So tri the triangle projectile costs mana, I guess. Kauri. Well, hello there, Gogas. It warms my heart to see new faces around camp, but I'm afraid you've chosen the worst time to explore this area of the Amazon. What brings you all here in such grim times? We're looking for Tunche, actually. Tunche? Oh dear, no. No, no, no. Why on earth would you be looking for him? Uh, okay, we each have different reasons, Lady Shaman, but we prefer to personal. Oh man, I don't know. I don't know how to voice the two characters there, but eh. I understand, but I can't, in good conscience, let you let you go to Tunche's domain without warning you first. The jungle's been overrun by all manner of abominations which are being led by magical creatures of immense power. They've destroyed everything and everyone in their way, and I suspect Tunche is involved. We can take them. Yeah, no problem. 
Ooh. <laughs> All right, good. But I've conjured up a barrier to shield us from danger. All the same, so you'll need to get in and out of safely. And I'm creating a magical link with you so we can communicate all, at all times once you're in there, just in case. Let me know when you're ready. Sure. I don't... I, I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh gosh. For that terrible voice acting. Whoa, okay, my controller changed colors. Interesting. It fits with the environment. Hello, 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 Vigor. How are you? Welcome back. Whoa. Yeah, hi, I'm Sasha. Pretty much the guy in charge here. Carbon mentioned you were late last night. Did you have potential or something? To be honest, I don't really see it. But might I but might as well put you to the test. Change you to fight and stuff. Man, the character design is very cool looking. I don't need any lessons from you, mister. Look, newbie. I'm not exactly doing this for you, alright? Just knowing I give you a fighting chance puts any responsibility off my shoulders. Something happens to you out there, it's on you. Especially if you plan to go into Tunche's domain. But... No buts, just listen. Notice that the tingling sensation that you are feeling all across your body? Yeah, that's magic. It exists everywhere, but it thrives here in the rainforest. But don't be surprised if your natural abilities are enhanced somehow. Now go on, show me what you can do with it. Square basic melee, circle to evade, X to jump. Yo, is that, is that supposed to be a frog? It is. Two hit combo, three hit combo. Okay. You're good. Did you make any progress in Hollow Knight? Bigger? I, I did look up uh, I did look up on how to install a mod on Hollow Knight so I might I might trim Hollow Knight after I finish with this game the the modded Hollow Knight run so yeah I'm I'm looking forward to that we'll see we'll see how it goes then have you tried the modded version bigger to send enemies into the air Whoa. I have no coordination whatsoever
interesting I'm going to perform magic blah 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 Oh my god, it's <laughs> oh my god, it's kind of like a uh, devil might cry then. Stylish, great, okay, interesting. Well, look at you. It seems you're not a total disaster after all. Anyway, here's the plan. You go on ahead and deal with the abominations and I'll go back to camp and continue napping. See you later, newbie. Try not to die, alright? Whoa, what is this? Essence obtained. Use it to unlock, 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 or upgrade skills at a skill tree. Interesting. Checkpoint. Hey, okay, interesting. Your Hollow Knight is a file, not the actual app. Oh, I see, I see. But I guess we're gonna explore it together then, okay? <laughs> I'm excited to see. There's a lot of customization actually in the Hollow Knight mod. So I'm excited to see how much I can do in that in the apps. Sorry, not apps. In the mod. The skill tree is now available. Access it by talking to talking with Sasha once you return to camp. Okay, I see. Uh oh. Interesting. Okay. Now, that is most unusual, and yet, it seems someone's looking out for you, Gua Gua. What you have there is a spiritual core, a relic of intense power. Wow, it's magical, isn't it? The magic of a spirit resides within it. Distilled and transmuted at the time of its creation. But you can't imagine how rare an occurrence that is. The amount of power involved and the familiarity you need with it is unimaginable. Not to mention a willing spirit would need to sacrifice its own existence in order for you to make a spiritual core. What would you have that kind? What? What? Who would have that kind of power? Oh, sorry, that was a kid. Oh God. Okay, I have no idea. But the fact that it was given to you, it makes me think you have a mighty ally on your side. Interesting. Spiritual core. Once collected, you immediately gain access to its unique perks. Triggered under special circumstances. Spiritual blah blah blah, different types. Once you can find, transform. Transform it into shards. If your HP drops to zero, you'll drop all your cores. Interesting. Hmm.
interesting, interesting. Those spheres are called shards. <laughs> Though they are the only thing that remains when a spiritual core is destroyed. You know what? I'm not gonna do the voice acting. It's... Oh god. It's really harm, harming my throat. Most of their power is lost when this happens, but I've heard that there's a way to harness it and reuse it. Seriously, then please do it. I'm afraid my under and understanding of this kind of magic is limited. You shamans devil in it, blah blah blah. Okay, sure lady, sure, sure, sure. Hmm, so far I have to say this game is um quite linear, I have to say. gonna read this oh god I don't have time um kill a small amount of HP for 15 points pair potion refills a po potion slot do I even need killing I can't do anything. Okay. And now be upgraded. Okay. Whoa, okay. So it is kind of like a roguelite, huh? Where you have the option to choose. So I'm guessing this one increased my life. This is one to Hunts. I don't know. This is shop. Let's get more life then. I don't know. I don't know how this game works. Literally, there's no. Whoa! Oh god! Hello? You dare hurt me? Perfect hell. Hello? Interesting. Hello? Regeneration. Ooh, slowly heal whenever your current hit point are below a quarter of your maximum hit. Okay, interesting. Interesting. What is this? Hello? Ciao. Um, story, chapter one. Ooh, you're playing Clash Royale while watching me? Ooh, nice. Hope you enjoy it. Hello? So, okay. 
the ground maybe used to be a pond i don't know then the kid naruto running into the forest i'm a bird i'm a bird then a giant tortoise said no you're not kid no you're not what oh okay <laughs> i thought <laughs> that's actually dialogue okay oh didn't see you there young one blah 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 roaming this part of the jungle okay interesting evil and dangerous blah 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 oh my god so creepy back up i'm not afraid of anything turtle lady you should be okay i'm not a bird oh my god <laughs> Oh my god. You're human, but you have wings. Human don't have wings, you know. This isn't how I normally look. Whoa. Interesting. I don't understand. Okay. Interesting. Hopefully, blah blah blah. So what this kid saying that is a human, but due to certain circumstances, he had the ability to use wings as his weapon. To become a hunter but the giant turtle lady doesn't like being deceived and she sees the boy as a bird due to the characteristic of the wing okay interesting Otello mama What a friendly turtle. Wow, really? You never pay attention. Ooh. You never pay attention to the elderly, huh? Hello, who are you? Oh my god. Water spirit. Interesting. Okay, so maybe the spirit can help, blah blah blah. Trees murdered about shadows and chaos deeper in the jungle. Unche. Hmm. To be honest, I am losing interest in this game. <laughs> to be honest, most. Oh god. Oh. Leo? Oh my god. Interesting. God. Challenge tutorial play a challenge by paying the required amount of gold pieces between you and your allies. You can ask for a refund at any time. Gold is only expended once the challenge started. If you complete the challenge, you will win the reward shown on the board, but if you lose, you'll walk away empty handed. If your HP drops to zero, you'll be sent back to camp. Do I even want to? Okay, what kind of UI is this? Hello? I... oh god. What is this? Is that a macaron? Okay, the character design, the overall vibe is really cool, I have to say, but 
I don't know, something something about the gameplay is really subpar to me. I don't know, I don't know, I, I just don't feel the vibe of this game. It didn't make any sense. And I've played even more even more boring game than this. I am tempted. You know what? You know what? I am committed to at least to at least do a full session with this game. So why not, right? Interesting. Just made a new deck in Clash of Royale, you mean? Figure? Hey, I'm not very familiar with Clash Royale, but maybe you can describe to me what is the deck you are building. Oh my god, is it lag? Oh god, it is lagging. Interesting. Oh, giant slob. Mapping Guari. I smell trespassing scum. Ugh, and I smell vomit. If um, if my natural order overwhelms you, it only proves how weak you are. Ooh, burn! I really hope Tunche isn't as smelly and ugly as you. Tunche, he told me to eat everyone that come to this way. I don't like to be given orders, but I very much like that one. I'm going to enjoy eating you. Oh. Oh, snap. Okay, I... 
you in the night. It's not as hard, but I did get my ass cake. Hmm, interesting. You know what? Let's try playing as head girl. Hello, dear PC. Hello, my name is not PC. needed for level 2 I have 25 okay whatever I'm gonna try and do it again okay so vigor you said that each deck has 8 cards and you need to destroy the king tower of the enemy or have more destroyed towers when time runs out I can see. The first card is a bomber, He's ha he has 294 damage and 440 health. He hits only ground units and building and has an average low, low attack speed, does area damage. E. He deals quite a lot of damage, huh? 294 as compared to his health which is 200 and 440. It is a common card. E. Interesting, but his attack is a bridge to slower. So that makes it balance, I guess. Interesting. So there's a skill tree. Interesting. Oh, so I don't have any essence, so I can't do anything. There is a combo system in this game. Yo, okay. Scooter badge. Okay, interesting. Ah, okay, okay. But how? Oh my god, so each time I change characters, my, uh, my controller changed color, 
Interesting. So since I'm using Head Girl, her color is primarily purple. My controller is changing into purple. Interesting. This Guardian Flight. After doing an air dash, you can glide and drop damaging pathlets until you reach the ground. Oh my god. Do it again, head girl. Yeah! Oh my god, that is so cute. <laughs> Did she do that in her game? Second card is the Archer Queen. She is a champion. Each deck can have only one champion. She has one one thousand three hundred and thirty health and two hundred and ninety nine damage. Has an average attack speed and can hit both air and ground units. Uh, also champions has an ability Archer Queen for one elixir becomes invisible. Gains 180% more damage boost for 3 pin. Each, uh, also during a match, you can have up to 10 elixirs max and regain it after spending it. Bomber is 2 elixir and Archer Queen is 5 elixirs. Wait, what? Okay, um, I don't understand the final, uh, the last sentence there. So the 10 elixirs max, so why does the Archer Queen need to use 5 elixirs if 1 elixir can make you become invisible and gain 180% more damage boost for 3 seconds? I don't know, <laughs> I'm, I'm a little bit confused there for a bit. why she needs five elixirs it needs five elixirs to activate the ability to invisible to become invisible and gains the 100 180 percent damage boost Is that it Queen to be deployed in the match she needs five of okay okay now I understand so in order to deploy the character you need five elixirs but only one to activate their abilities I see I see the third card is the arrows and this card is not a unit but it's a spell for three elixirs it deals 486 damage in a 1.4 tile radius. 
Okay, Elixirs deal 486 damage. I see. Wait, I'm a little bit confused um, again. Whoa! said that um arrows is a the spell right not a unit but um does that mean that if you oh okay so if i rem uh if i interpret this correctly so the arrow is a spell right so does that mean you get gain um in exchange for a unit card, you gain a DPS. You increase your damage output towards the opponent. Is that right? Ah, okay, so in exchange for a unit, you have less unit on your end, but you have the potential to increase your damage output. Gee. Are you kidding me? The legendary card in next three elixirs it deals 345 damage in an area and has 1600 health with average to slow attack speed and can hit ground units and buildings also it is invisible to the enemy units and buildings until it hits something when it becomes invisible uh, visible again Okay, Royal Ghost thing. So it it needs three elixirs to deploy. Ah, I see, I see. Oh, wait. Oh. I, w I was thinking. Um, isn't the Royal Ghost quite strong due to its high HP? But uh, then I look at the queen. Yeah, the royal ghost has much higher HP compared to the queen, right? Well, it's invisible. Nothing can hit it, with the exception being the enemy spell. I see. It is good, but not that much. I see. Kind of like a tank, huh? Thing. Whoa! You dare? Oh god. Think 
interesting interesting behavior fifth you have the skeleton dragon skeletron dragons a common card for four elixir you deploy two skeleton dragons each has a 213 area damage 705 health with slow attack speed and they can hit air and ground units and buildings interesting so they have the combined hp of 14 1410 1400 health and 400 area damage okay okay i see i see how it is gonna be quite strong how common it is to have a an air unit in the game Kidding me. Hello? The ninety percent of players use air units. Oh, okay. So it's not something uncommon, in fact it is really common since 90% of the players use air units. Then you have the giant, a rare card, 5 life, 5 elixirs, has 300, uh, 337 damage, whoa, 5423 health, average attack speed, but unlike other units, the giant goes directly to the enemy buildings ignoring enemy units see i see so it can only attack the enemy buildings not the units itself but can the other unit attack him i'm guessing yes right <laughs> maybe that's why for its high hp yeah okay i understand So far, you only shown me units and spell cards, right? You haven't shown me any statistic for building. <coughs> but my throat, I'm gonna mute for a bit to cough. Man, my throat is damaged right now. Oh god, okay. Now you got one of your favorite cards in the game. I see. Ooh, I'm interested.
monster. How dare you attack me? game is so unsatisfying I don't know I don't know so unsatisfying to say the least second chance soon cat kid yeah yeah cat how are you by the way hello hello uh, this is Tunchi, which is a game, and the reason why I even pick it up is because of Head Girl that is inside the promotional video that is inside the game. I was confused as to why there is Head Girl in the game. <laughs> you're good? Nice. Glad to know you're good. How about me? Well, um... Uh, I am currently damaged. <laughs> I'm, I just get better from a sickness. I had a flu-like um, sickness. Even right now, I'm, I'm quite phlegmy to say the least. So that's why my voice is a little bit different. And also the past few weeks, I'm, I didn't get to stream as much because um, life has been hectic for me, so yeah, a lot of things happen. Uh, I guess that's life, huh? So I'm I'm glad you're doing much better. Have you heard about this game, Cat? I don't know, so far the game, this game that I'm playing right now, Tunche, has a very charming art style, but the combat does seem a little bit lacking, in my opinion. It's a little bit hectic. Uh, get it? Hat tick. Oh my god. But I don't know. Maybe I'm just not good enough at the game. And also, because it is a side scrolling 3D game, I. I don't know, I, I had a much difficulty judging the depth of the enemies. Oh, okay, I'm so sorry about that, Vigor. Okay. Um, the Witch card is an epic, um, require 5 elixir, uh, has 178 damage area 1110 health fast attack speed and hits the air ground units and buildings oh it hit them all huh then every seven seconds 
she she summons four skeletons that are same level as her. Wait, so the skeletons is the same level as her, but how how much are their HP? Interesting. No wonder it is your favorite cards, huh? Yeah, I see. Oops, what is this? I am so doomed. I mean, look at that. I I cannot judge the devil. God, I have 27 HP and I have to defeat a boss fight? No way I can defeat this guy. Right? I don't know. Okay, interesting. Let's see. Yes, dance, head girl, dance. What the? 
Okay, so that is really cheap. So always, always at the 300 L, I get get demolished. Okay, so the lastly, you got the, the baby dragon epic card. Requires four elixir card, deals 212 area damage, and has 1,526 health with average attack speed and can hit air and ground units and buildings. That doesn't sound very... very strong. Especially compared to the other four elixir card, which is the Skeletron Dragon. Thing. Baby Dragon is actually strong since it's an air unit. Oh. Is the Skeletron Dragon not an air unit? Thing. Oh. oh my god, this big boy. Man, my controller is showing a bright yellow right now for this character. Oh my god, it is a little bit slow. Poncho! Poncho punch! What is this? Interlink? While your stylish grade is A and higher, basic melee against an enemy will create a ray. Thing. Skeleton dragons are also air units, but baby dragon has more health and than both skeleton dragons combined. Oh, okay. DAC. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so Pancho is the heart eating character. What is this? Rush. Go faster while your stylish grid is A or higher. Oh, that's not gonna help me because I never got a, a grid A or higher. <laughs> okay, interesting.
I don't know, I don't know. I'm not sure if this game is even my cup of tea. What is this? Um, sorry, I'm not interested in this. Ooh, what is this? attack seems to have an effect in the magic that surrounds us here uh, entropy obtained the stylish grid with which you and an enemy or boss encounter comes toward filling the entropy meter the higher the grid the more it, f it will fill Two or more players remain undefeated at the end of the encounter. The salish grid will be tallied and the average count to blah blah blah. Okay then. Mana attacks have a chance to temporar temporarily burn enemies. Okay, interesting. What's this? Oh no, not the book! No! I'm not here for the story time. Sorry, okay, whatever. You know what? Let's skip. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, boss fight time. I will not be defeated again this time. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Okay. Famous last word. <laughs> You're right. My problem is that I got a two cocky.
Skill added to the skill tree, bestial vitality and bestial ferocity. Thing. Having all of Mappy's power would just makes me numb. But all of, most of all, I feel of what I would become. Hey, okay, interesting. I'm sure the character has some very deep. Um, story development but apparently I'm not I'm not um, invested in the story enough Puerto Pro Providencia Ooh. can I Can I buy hell something? Oh thing. I can I can buy hell. Okay, the required amount of gold piece to buy any of the spiritual core shown. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna need some healing. Eh, okay, whatever. You will lurk for a bit, okay. You lurk, okay? That's gonna be here. Transmutation are now available for purchase. Talk with Ugi at camp to gain access to them. Hello? Miss Key? But look at that, living breathing people and Sasha said I would be only fine corpses. Did he send you looking at me? Because there was nothing of use at the village and I'm actually on my way back. Sasha and Kari didn't send us. And me? Us meeting was luck. Why come here? Is there anything you lack? Come on man. I'm just gonna skip. <laughs> Interesting. Ukumaris 
message obtained. Okay. Is that good or is that bad? I'm not even sure. Oh god. We are fighting fishes. Interesting. What is this? Luck of the mystics. Why well, yours oh god. Why? Why do I need to get a slight stylish grade A or higher? Well whatever. Okay. I deal critical damage to I deal the damage oh god at the back of the enemies. That, oh my god. Interesting mechanic. So the that is the llama. This is the opposite of the llama. Oh shoot! understand the mechanic of this game is quite confusing to say the least so this dude or gal I'm not even sure is a fast attack character he Okay. Transmutation. Healing fountain. Yo, okay. Still don't have any essence. Which is odd.
air recovery. Ooh. Okay, okay, whatever. I'm just just gonna just gonna skip things. Okay, hopefully this time around I'm gonna do much better. Ooh, my controller now is pink. Interesting. Shouldn't it be red? Interesting, interesting. to hurt me monkeys or oh, now I'm Mana attacks have a chance to slow enemies. Interesting, interesting. Lightning. Is that the one that makes me move faster or what? Juggling this enemies, huh? Interesting. Oh, great A or above. Okay, okay.
Earth Spirit. Interesting. So the symbol on the portal is not very clear. kind of combo you can I see that you can do another kind of combo but you need to buy it I feel like I feel like having the Ancho Ancho character is much better for my playstyle. Come on, man.
Oh, you're back, digger? Nice, nice. I'm still here struggling with this game. Hmm, interesting. What if I go to back to camp right now? What will happen? Closing the game instead of going back. Yeah, no, I'm I'm gonna go back to the camp. Oh, interesting. So let's play with the final character here. And Naira. Oh. Oh. Hello. Is 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 that is that uh an incomplete game element? No localization text found. Checkpoint. Um sure. <laughs> Interesting. Nara looks cute, she does. Hopefully her playstyle is not too brutal to say the least. What? No. Okay, you know what? No. <laughs> I I thought oh god, I don't know. Yeah, I guess I I did. Interesting. So you should have told me the game is zero out of ten. Unplayable. <laughs> Didn't tell me what to do. Interesting. But I guess I cannot complain that much because I did get this for free. But oh man, I feel bad to those that um I don't know. Oh so she can attack on the front and the back. Interesting. So that's gonna be useful in a group fight. Man, my depth perception is not that great. <laughs> okay, interesting, interesting. We already lose 10 health. Interesting, interesting. Whoop.
interesting. I'm I'm quite interesting interested in knowing what makes an attack critical and what make it makes it not. I'm guessing there must be a mechanic that I didn't know, right? Oh god. chance thank you very much okay yeah this game I feel like uh, needs something I don't know for a game that wants to be like a devil may cry it is very sluggish I don't know then again the only devil may cry game I've only played is the remix one I never played any of the DMC game other than that I actually love playing the remake game, the DMC Devil May Cry remake. I know it is, uh, the game is not well received by fans, but I don't know, as someone that doesn't have an experience with the series, what the, f hello? Yeah, as someone that doesn't have any experience with the series, I feel like the game is not a okay. What's up with this? I personally prefer the in this game the heavy attack of Pancho. I don't know. Even though in any other game I really dislike a, a slower attack character game or weapon.
Interesting, interesting. Hmm. Okay. Okay, interesting, interesting. What is this? Chance for your stylish glade, glade, glade to remain uninfected after getting hit. Okay, interesting. Oh man. Interesting. So I still have to fight just like in any other roguelikes, huh? Okay, interesting. Hello? Okay, this game is... I don't know, I... I'm frustrated with it. How did that hit me?
Yeah. Okay. Hmm, interesting. I don't know, maybe... Maybe my preferred character so far that fits with my playstyle in this game is Pancho. Panchi? Pancho. He's a little bit slow, but... Better than nothing, huh? Okay. One more run and then we'll call it a day? Man, I don't know. This past few weeks, my body has been... I don't know. I've been quite lethargic. I wish my body wouldn't do... Stuff like that. Look, look at how strong he is. I can glide. Okay. Yeah, my body has been quite lethargic. Twice? Hello? Mm. See if I can do this as quickly as possible. Bit, but I don't I don't I don't see any gauge increase that run in that previous route. The first time I've seen a dead enemy split in half. That's a cute detail.
I hit you guys? Interesting. far so good but I don't I don't think I'm gonna survive the boss fight this time around Why is there so many monkeys? Hello? So many frogs, so many monkeys. been worse okay boss fight time hmm interesting I wish there's a way for me to skip all of this can I? No, I can't. How strong the guy is. Oh my god.
Whoa. Again, my depth perception is not good at this game. Oh. Well, that's Dunche. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna go back into this game. Maybe, maybe this game is just not my my cup of tea, to say the least. Next stream Hollow Knight, yes, most probably. I'm gonna see. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see um, what kind of mod I'm gonna install in Hollow Knight. But I'm excited. Uh, so that has been my stream for today. I know I'm not. I'm not as energetic as I were. Like before, I take. Uh, a few a few weeks break I'm slowly I'm slowly trying to relearn back my streaming skill oh gosh when you didn't get the stream for quite a long time I don't know it it does things to your brain and the fact that my uh, my mouth still recovering from an ulcer that doesn't help one that doesn't help much either, but eh, I'm still trying my best here. But, oh, download the mod where it gives Primal Aspect machine guns. Oh no! Primal Aspect is already hard enough. And now you want me to give Primal Aspect machine guns? We'll see, we'll see. <laughs> it must be funny, right? But we'll see how it goes. Um. Yeah, next week. Oh, right. Um, should do this. So, yeah, this is the, the updated streaming schedule for me. So, we have the Saturday and Sunday slot of, uh, only for streaming. The rest of the days, I will not be streaming due to I have things that I need to do. Plus, I'm still recovering from my um, thickness I have to say and I need a little bit of a rest um, but I hope that I could increase back my streaming frequency to back to how I were previously but yeah for now this is the streaming schedule that I have right now um, Saturday, Saturday next week, I'm gonna go back into, um, what game was I playing yesterday? I already forgot. <laughs> uh, is it, uh, Call of the Lamb? Yes. I'm gonna go back into Call of the Lamb on Saturday. And then on Sunday, I'm gonna do a modded Hollow Knight run. Which mod? You'll have to find out next week. But for now, I'm gonna sign off and have the night, have a nice rest of your weekend. For me, tomorrow is a new weekday, <laughs> and to those that are already in the future. <laughs> I hope you have a pleasant work day ahead of you. But for now, I'm gonna sign off. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next stream. Bye-bye.